Here's Mike Gatino. I want to talk about Mind Medicine Inc. It trades on the OTC markets under symbol MMEDF. It was up almost 9% yesterday, up to $3.54. Um, this has been a stock that has been trying to uh, break through that big $5 uh, level of resistance for, you know, that usually penny stocks have trouble breaking through. You could see um, over the past month it was able to move from $1 up to almost uh, $5, and then it, it you know hit that wall of resistance, that $5 wall of resistance, and move down. However, it's beginning to move back up, so you should keep it on your radar because I do think My Medicine can make a run towards $5 a share over the next couple months. Uh, My Medicine basically they create psychedelic medicines for a bunch of different uh, type of thera therapies, mostly uh, you know mental therapies, just be able to um, you know make you feel better. Uh, the alternative medicine, I think, is only going to grow over the next couple of years. And especially, you know, if you look at cannabis uh, being allowed for medicinal use in the United States and more and more states, and it might be uh, legalized on a nationwide basis, that gives uh, hope for companies involved in, you know, psychedelic and other alternative medicine. So you should definitely keep your eye on Mind Medicine, uh, not just because of the business it's in and the trend towards allowing different types of therapies uh, in the United States, but also the fact that the price action is beginning to look really good. And when you see a big 9% move like this, you really can't ignore it. So um, just looking at the uh, one month chart here, it's next level of resistance is going to be 437. If you could go through 437, they can make that charge towards $5. And if it could break through $5, then you're going to see a whole new level of buyer coming in and it could easily head up to 6 or $7. So it, I definitely think that Mind Medicine is worth uh, taking the risk. Um, the only word of caution I would say is I am anticipating a sell-off in the market in January, and that's because a lot of people who made profits during the year 2020 will want to sell in 2021 so they can wait another 16 months before paying capital gains tax. So that's just one thing to keep in mind. If you do have a sell-off, these penny stocks tend to sell off pretty hard. So just keep that in mind. However, I do think over the long term, my medicine will do really well, and you definitely want to watch it as it approaches the $5 a share level. So Definitely keep my mind medicine on your radar. And again, I stay in another video that if you want to trade penny stocks, they're not available on Webull or Robinhood. You'll need to use a larger platform such as TD Ameritrade, Schwab, um, one of the larger platforms. So go ahead and check out my medicine trades on the OTC market and the symbol MMEDF. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and go ahead and subscribe and turn on notifications. I do multiple daily updates on stocks, options, and stock trading strategies. Thanks a lot. Bye.